Well, hey there, everybody. We're going to do something a little different this afternoon. Um, I picked up something new for SEMO, uh, and I've been wanting to change away from the Acura for a little bit. Uh, nothing particularly screaming bad about the Acura. I just didn't care for it, and uh, I was actually flipping through Facebook one day and ran across this, and I actually found a switch panel first, and I ordered it, and I got to looking, and I was why don't I go ahead and get the math fold too and we'll give it a shot. Well, why not? Uh, this is number 68 if I remember right. So it's still a fairly new company. Uh, Chad Chris uh, makes these and uh, it's the 8XL. I got mine in black. I got it from Camber Creations. Uh, TJ up there, he did really good price on it and had it here really quickly. But what else say we open this thing up, take a look at it and see what we can find out about it. I haven't even tried to open this thing yet, so hopefully we can actually get into it. All right, let's see here. Of course, you gotta have a sticker, right? <laughs> oh, that's nice. Actually tells, wiring. One year warranty on it. It's got the wiring diagram how the bags are set up and such as that. Oh, we got plugs. Plugs are always nice. Um, I'm going to assume these are going to be for the gauges, gauge ports, but we will take a look here in a minute and find out. Now let's see what we got. This thing is wrapped up nice. <laughs> it is well wrapped, well cared for. The packaging is really nice and wow. Would you look at that? <laughs> it's so bright and you can ready to see it. Wow. That's all I've got for that. Pigtail. Alright. There's your ports. Oop. Getting a reason. Of course, here's the ports crossed here. They're actually numbered. This thing is nice. All right. First impression on it is this thing is super nice. It seems well built. Um, Maybe we see it a little better. Uh, I would get the black because it fits with my idea of what I'm going to go with here in a little bit. Uh, I've got ports. Both ends. Alright. The only thing it doesn't have, I don't see, is an Allen wrench to take it apart where we can see inside. So uh, I'm going to run out of shop real quick and we'll get this thing apart and see what's inside. Wow, guys. All right, I got this thing took apart. Um, this is the hardware for keeping the covers all together. It's actually really nice stuff. Uh, I've got the mid plate and the top cover. And of course, here's the manifold itself. Um, on this, I was pretty impressed. It's got both two pressure side, two exhaust, of course. And then, of course, all the lines. But it has this neat little journal right here for running all your wiring and through and such. Across here, as I'm gonna guess, you can either use your plugs, or in my case, I'm gonna use gauge lines coming through here. And then down here on this end, it's got a hole for your pressure gauge. All right, yeah, I said pressure gauge, didn't I? <laughs> oh, okay, pressure switch, I'm sorry. Pressure switch, go down here. Uh, the wiring on it's all done really well and I'm pretty impressed with it. It all looks really serviceable. Um, the solenoids themselves all look to be pretty quality. Everything's mounted well. Um, of course, till we get it mounted, which will be a little bit, won't be able to do a whole lot with it. But uh, another neat thing I've seen is it actually has the date it was built engraved in down here. This thing is really nice I and mean, it feels good it looks good 
I'm impressed. The mounting is, uh, I was told there's VU AccuWare mounting holes, and then there's also some other holes in here. So you got a couple options on how to mount it. It looks really nice. Like I said, I'm pretty impressed with it. Uh, I can't wait to get this thing mounted and see how it does. As uh, soon as I get that done, we will put more videos up of it, of course. And as soon as my switch plate plate gets here, we'll take a look at it as well. But till then, I'm probably fixing to go out here get in the shop, and that means there's a solid chance of another video coming fairly soon. But till then, if you like what you're seeing, of course, subscribe to the channel. Um, Chad Chris Designs, I'm really impressed with this so far. Like I said, the look, fit, finish, everything, all it's perfect. It's pretty awesome.